everybody actually is addicted to something, okay? There are some people out there addicted to some crazy fucked up shit. There are people out there who are addicted to things like cigarettes. Unfortunately, there's also people out there addicted to things like drugs. The world is mine, nigga, get back. Don't fuck with my stack. The gauge is wrecked. About to drop the bomb, I'm the motherfucking... There's sex addicts, porn addicts, all types of addicts out there. People with literal physical dependencies to things, right? And I'm glad this person asked this question, asked me about the strange addiction. You know, I actually haven't seen the TV show, but it's been promoted a lot. There's this TV show called My Strange Addiction where there's people who, like, addicted to eating glass, addicted to eating the fucking paint chips off the wall, uh, baby powder, you know, all this crazy fucking shit that people are really, really addicted to, cat food, and I was thinking, damn... Am I actually addicted to something? And, I, and the first thing, something popped into my mind. Because I'm like, shit. It's kind of strange. I'm not necessarily addicted, but fuck, man. Shit, I really, really love doing it. And I do it every day. And I just kind of realized, like, I don't know if I'm addicted. Because I've been doing it for a long time. I haven't stopped. And it's just kind of like, fuck. Maybe... Maybe I should get you guys onto it too because I'm telling you it's changed my life and the second I started doing it I was like damn My life has changed and it's honestly a lot better So I thought I'd share it with you guys and discuss what I think my strange addiction is one day I discovered something Mind-blowing just fucking oh my god One thing you got to know about me is that fuck man. I'm a hairy dude I'm hairy, okay? I got hair on the fucking top of my head. I got hair on my chin. I got hair on my balls and my my pubic area. My ass crack. My toes. I'm, I'm hairy. And I think a lot of guys are hairy. Especially in the genitalia and asshole area. I'm assuming you got some fucking hair down there. It's a common place for dudes to grow hair. I was in the shower one day. And I was shaving. I'm cleaning myself the fuck up. And I'm like, maybe I should get rid of this fucking jungle that's sitting in my ass crack. So I do it. And I do it. And holy shit. It's gay as fuck, kind of. Like, that seems like some something a fucking gay dude would do, you know? Just having his asshole all clean so he could get fucked by all these dudes. But I think it's a very manly thing to be able to put a razor in your ass crack, your sensitive little anus area, and take away that hair. Because it has mind-blowing, super crazy benefits that will last you throughout your life. It's healthy. It keeps it nice and clean. Because the next time you take a dump, the next time you take a shit, you'll be like, holy fuck, I don't have to use this much fucking toilet paper, like 12 of these fucking squares. I could use two. Because there's... It's so clean. It's so nice back there. And I'm not walking around out there in the sun, sweating my fucking ass crack off, getting these sweaty balls, because it's nice and fresh back there. It's nice and... It's just fucking not so hot, okay? But yeah, this is something I started doing, right? And it got to the point where I didn't even give a fuck about my balls and my pubes. Like, I have a girlfriend, and it's like, I don't... Yeah, I got fucking hair. I'm a dude. But my asshole stays shaven. I'm going to tell you guys this because I think you should try it out. For real. Not in like some homosexual, hey guys, <laughs> shave your asshole. Like, hey man, I want you to have, live a better life and I want you to be happy. And I want you to experience this fucking thing that's just, holy fuck, it's so simple. It's so fucking easy. And you might be addicted to it. So I don't want you guys getting on a path where you end up in a 12-step program where you're like, God... I can't stop shaving my asshole. But at the same time, it's not a bad thing to be addicted to because I shower every day. I really do. I make sure I shower every day and every time I'm in there, I will make sure the asshole has no hair in it. Not the asshole itself, but the crack and... Yeah, I guess the asshole itself. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I recommend you shave your asshole. 
that is my strange addiction. It's kind of strange, and it's something that I really wouldn't want to live without. So let me know what your strange addiction is, and let me know if you guys have any video ideas for me to talk about. Love you, kings and queens. Goodbye! Excuse me! My name is Royal Gilly!